Hello and welcome to the City of Roses, Portland, Oregon. The venue is Providence Park. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from MLS. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, for the visitors, an awful lot they need to do better in terms of scoring goals. Look at that record, Stuart. Not a pretty sight. Well, quite simply, away from home, they just don't get enough players into forward areas. They need to get the midfield players to make runs. They need the fullbacks to play higher up the field and the forwards to run behind the opposition. It has to change soon and it has to be today. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre isolated and it could be difficult for them. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're playing the same shape, really, so it's all about getting control of that central area and which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game. And so the battle commences. Nice looking pass. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. A really vital interception. Decent position. Not a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. And there's the delivery. No nonsense clearance. Ring. Dominguez on the ball. Alexander Ring. And the attack looks promising. This looks interesting. in the center but nothing to worry about Yimmy Chara Diego Chara and moving the ball nicely no worries for the keeper Pochettino Well the attack will peter out Keeper's ball Felipe Mora Well he could really get at the opposition Over the touchline for a throw in. Perfectly fair tackle, and it will be a corner. Well, they haven't had too much to cheer about for a while now, but the goal would be a huge bonus here. A 
And now the delivery. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. The match has restarted, 1-0 here. Well-timed tackle. Using his strength to shield the ball. He's given it straight to the opposition. So, getting close to the half-time interval, and it's going with home advantage, albeit not by a lot. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen so far? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled oh, the Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. And a goal. The equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. He has time to play it over. Just wanted to get it out of there. Might be able to get in behind the defence. That's not a bad ball. Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Lima. Pochettino. Alexander Ring. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Pochettino. Ring. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Big chance. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Keen to take it short here. And he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. 
well read to ease the pressure Christian Paredes and players waiting in the centre Van Rankin Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Chance to take the lead. Well, body in the way. Shown inside. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. There to win it back. Sebastian Blanco. He could pick out a teammate. It might be. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Let's see about the delivery. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Just couldn't get it through. Still alive. Well, threat averted. Well, that was a bit unlucky, because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. Takes the shot. Oh, a superb save. Cascante. Ring. Inside the final 15 minutes. Gite. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Could be a chance to break here. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And a time for composure on the ball. Musa Jite. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Well, that is how to play advantage. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Can he put them in front? Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, following on from the previous incident, he sees yellow now. Substitution for Portland Timbers. Coming off the pitch, number 27, Dairon Astria. Coming onto the pitch, number 7, Andy Polo. And there's the delivery. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And with that, the 90 minutes have come to an end. An even contest.